Story tonight at 10, such a sad story. A family dealing with immeasurable grief after an 11 year old boy dies in a freak accident in Rocky Point. The boy was kicked in the head by a horse. And as Team 12's Michael Doudna tells us, the family is receiving support from friends, family, and community here in Arizona. Every person that he came in contact with, he touched their hearts. Maria and her daughter Justine remembering Andre Brokovich Garcia for his smile, his love of sport, and all the promise now cut short. He was a dream, and he will always continue to be that. Back in February, Andre was volunteering, working with horses that normally help those with disabilities in Rocky Point. That day, we weren't supposed to go, but we went. And while working in the stalls, a horse kicked Andre in the head. I was, I started yelling for help and help. I seen him on the floor just bleeding and bleeding. Andre would be rushed to a nearby hospital in Mexicali. A life-saving procedure seemed initially to work. Uh, Saturday he was doing good. Sunday he was doing good. And I don't know what happened Sunday after Sunday night that he stopped breathing. Andre would be declared brain dead and pass away four days later. As every day goes by, it's harder and it gets harder and harder. And I thought it, I thought it was going to be easier, and it's, and it's not. But in these darkest of times, support and hope coming from back home. It's literally everyone in Arizona. See, Maria has lived in Rocky Point since Andre was born, but her roots remain here in Arizona, where her other children still live. And after Andre's death, friends, family, even strangers coming forward to raise more than $18,000 for a family and in memory of a boy they may never have met. Yeah, I just want to thank everybody Yay! that I will continue to love him and I won't forget about him. Not this time, the family would appreciate your prayers and support. And while they still do have that GoFundMe, they are amazed with the generosity shown so far. We're in Phoenix, Michael Doudna, 12 News.